We need a revival that will make Christ so real to the members of our churches and his command to preach the gospel to every creature at home and abroad so imperative that everyone who names the name of Jesus will dedicate himself to the task of witnessing for Christ as Savior and Lord, beginning in his own home and continuing unto the uttermost parts of the earth. This was prayed for us when we were just a mission church. We were meeting in a basement and we didn't know what the Lord was gonna do. We had no idea the Lord was gonna form Highview Baptist Church. Biblical vision and mission isn't something we come up with. It's something we receive from God himself in his word. And I just wanna state our mission, our vision statement very clearly, and it's this, we exist to lead people to know and follow Jesus. This isn't simply about knowing some facts about Jesus, knowing kind of who Jesus is. This is about having been transformed by faith in the death, burial, resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead for the forgiveness of sins in His name, in His name alone. It's such a privilege to be together, united, thinking about the gospel, singing about Jesus. In our essence of who we are is a church. We belong to Him. And as a church, distinctively, we must be about the gospel. To proclaim the gospel, to speak the gospel, to celebrate the gospel, to sing about the gospel. God's heart is to reach people. God's heart is that people would know Him. And friends, we're talking about multiplying tonight and we're talking about that, that, that the action of the church to take what exists here and to take it where it doesn't exist. We want to start new churches and we want to start new ministries and we want to start new groups and we want to send new preachers and teachers because we want people to know God. But here's what I need you to understand. We will never multiply until God's heart gets a hold of our hearts. I view we must be on mission for the glory of Christ.